Okay, so today I would like to tell you something about calculation of uh, indicator. How to calculate mean downtime or mean time to repair or mean time between favor. We can look at the, this line, this uh, machine. And this machine produces some product, and this is uh, the timeline of the machine. And uh, we can see that we have here a downtime, and here somewhere here start time to repair, maintenance come coming here. And somewhere here, he give back the main equipment or machine to operator. And operator start normal production somewhere here. And when he start the normal production, uh, we start calculate time between failure. And uh, here we have again new downtime again maintenance intervention technician intervention and again again okay so how to calculate mean downtime so we have to look on the time of every downtime so we have downtime one and downtime one is one hour so we can calculate it like one hour plus another one downtime is two hours plus two hours and third downtime is one hour point Fifty half, and we can divide this by number of downtimes. It means one, two, and three. So divide it with number three, and it's equal. 1 plus 2 is 3 plus 1.5 is 4.5 divide 3 and it is 2, mean downtime is 1.5 hours okay now we can look how to calculate mean time to repair it is very similar because now we take just time of every uh, time to repair time, time to repair one time to repair two and time to re repair three so we can calculate this and TTR one is nula point six hours plus TTR two one hours plus TTR three one point two hours. And we can divide it again with number three. And it's equal it's equal nula point Ninety-three hours. 
Okay, and last indicator is mean time between failure. And now we can look at the time between failure, time between breakdown. So we have here three hours. Three hours plus next time between favor is six hours plus six hours and we can divide it number two and it is three three plus six is nine nine uh, we divide uh, with two and it is four point five hours okay I can explain well how we can look at this at this time at this time somewhere somewhere here then start breakdown what can be here here can be any logistic time what here yeah. it, it means uh, any time for maintenance technician to arrive after breakdown uh, next this time can be location and diagnostic time, diagnosis time. Uh, but when start time to repair, here we start with uh, some. We can divide this for TT, TT, R, A, and and B or C yeah. and this is diagnostic time and uh, here is any access time it means active maintenance time and here can be uh, spare parts taking time maybe D can be uh, any substitution time yeah, or uh, setup setup time and after closing time and maybe after that take again machine operator so this time is very is very It, it can be very different yeah okay and for uh, this situation we can we can we have a very similar situation if we have a plant maintenance activity uh, but uh, when we have a plant maintenance activity we can prepare logistic time before because we know what spare parts which spare part we need and we have after that just just um, this uh, active maintenance time so before we prepare everything and when machine stop we do just active maintenance time because we know what we want to do this is different between breakdown and 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 plan maintenance activities so thank you for the watching and uh, see you in the next video and if you like this video please subscribe thank you see you soon